Alright, I got up early two nights now this week. It's a lot cooler at night time. But this is how far I've gotten. I went ahead and started use, utilizing all these flanges. I went to a scrap iron place and they had a bunch of it. But eh, It looks big, but I wanted it that tall because I wanted to be able to comfortably shake, to use a shaker and the ash removal. Figured that'd be a lot easier. Ooh, we're fixing to have a nice little storm. Anyway, there it is. And there's my shaker, which it works off of that down there. Uh oh, we got a storm coming through. Anyway, uh, that's too close, isn't it? But anyway, here it is. All the way up. Again, I'm utilizing what I had. Just this is a real stainless stainless steel. It's a real thin wall. So I'm cooling. So remember in that cyclone I had a cooler? The, here are my two outlets. So anyway, I'll be able to start cooling in here. It'll come down. It'll cool in there. It'll cool somewhat there. I'll be able to cool here. And then from this point, I am going to... There's my filter. Of course, it stands, it stands up. And I went ahead and used that which is the actually used to be the top and now that is the bottom yeah anyway uh, I put a nipple right there I'm gonna use that copper I'm gonna put it inside so I went ahead and put that right there I put three legs so that my input from that won't be affected. I'm going to put uh, charcoal in here. I'm going to tap in right there and then come out. Well, actually, it's going to be on this side here. If you don't have no legs, it's hard to make it stand. In fact, hold on. Sorry. Now I can stand it up. Uh, that way I can cool in here also. I'm just, I'm all about cooling it. I feel like that is the key. I've mentioned that cooling thing. I just know that's a lot of, that's a lot of gas I'm going to be producing or a lot of smoke. So cool, 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 cool. I mean, everywhere I can cool in here. Well, it's going to start cooling in there, here, there, there. And when it goes through here, it'll cool there. And then from this filter, which I'm going to tap out. Wait, hold on. I'm going to go in here and come out here to this. This is the pre... That, that one there used to go to that one. But anyway, I'm going to utilize that smaller filter. That's a second filter with no cooling. And then I'm going to use one more filter, probably half that size. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it yet, but anyway, I want to use it with the cotton. There it is. It's coming together. There's my intake of the air now at my shop my big cabinet shop that I have I'm going to have an auger that goes down to a big cyclone that I have that collects all my dust and shavings and wood chips and all kinds of stuff and it'll be able to fall inside there 
again, <laughs> that's another day. But I put me some temperature gauges. I put one right there. I'll have another one. Well, you can't see it. Hold on. A little there and there, just to kind of keep track of the temperature. But there it is. Well, it's a bad shot. I'm getting there. It's uh again during the day I have to go to work unfortunately, but that's just life. That's it for now.